Hello, hello. Today I'm going to show you how to use and how to look a pressed up wolf, also called Sklevrand, wolf of ranch wolf. Um, this wolf is uh, commonly found in the high pressure road style and some mountain bicycles. Inner tubes, it comprises an outer wolf stem and an inner wolf body. A lock nut to secure the stem at the wheel rim and a wolf cap may also be present. And there it is, the inside of a pressed up wolf. First step, rotate the lock nut. Left turn to open the wolf. Nice, now the wolf is open if you push the stick down. Then the air comes in or comes out. Now we are going to drill a little bit of more. Now the lock nut is gone. And as you can see, this is the inside stick of the pressed up wolf. There it is. So it is easy to use. But nice, nice wolf. If you drill um, the secure lock nut right turn, then the wolf is closed, as seen in this example. Yeah, rotated left turn to open the wolf. Now the wolf is. Um, is, is still locked because you have to push the stick inside a little bit. After this, the air comes out because of the high pressure inside the tube. Yeah, automatically closed system. This is nice. Now let's close the pressed up wolf. Easy. Now it's closed. No air is coming in or is coming out out this is awesome um, this little rotation part is to lock um, the tube at the rim we will see this part later on a for example on a on a on a wheel at a bicycle okay let's now pump it up you will need the pump oh no, four, four, no, no. First, the example. This is a sampled wheel. The same procedure. Rotate left turn to open the wolf. Rotate right turn to close the wolf. Yeah, this is nice for tiny rims. Because the outer wolf stem is manufactured in various lengths or different applications and has mirrored diamonds. Diameter six millimeters. Okay, now let's come to the pump. The pump has two um, two parts. One part is for the, 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 the car and one part is for your Presta wolf, as seen like this. Now rotate the wolf open and then lock the pump on top by pressing it down. Nice. Now lock it. And now you are able to float air inside the tube. Pump it up. Pump it up, man. Good job. Now, this is enough. Oh, really nice. Um, the, maxim, the maximum pressure is 15 bar. Yeah, and the drill hole is 6.5 millimeters. Okay, now we are ready to use this part again. Dust cover on top, job's done. Easy, nice and good. High pressure. Wow. The air pressure in an inflated tire holds the inner wolf body shut. The small screw and captive nut on the top of the wolf body permits the wolf to be screwed shut and injure that is remaining tightly closed. The nut must be unscrewed to permit airflow in either direction. This must be done before attaching a palm. The screw remains 
captive on the valve body even when unscrewed fully. It is tightened again after the tires inflated and the pump removed. The valve cap protects the valve body, keeps dirt and mud out of the mechanisms and also prevents the valve from damaging the tube when it's rolled for storage, but it's not necessary to prevent pressure loss. Think about this. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe me and give me a positive feedback and see you next time. Soon soon.